Hi folks. Um, today is the 29th, 29th, 28th of August 2021 and it's about 11.30. I don't know if you can see the lights there and the sun at the window closest to me that I've sort of drawn nearer um, but the net's pulled back on so I'm going to go back to normal. Go to normal, see the flats, see the craft, see the craft at the middle. That's right, that's a bit you can see Vera, the poor brutalized plant by the cat. Okay, that's the middle section of my window, and that is the other window that you, you saw the other craft um, initially. And there's three one, one, two, three. Um, and like I keep saying, this is um, not hiding themselves. Let me just see if I can enlarge it, see if you can see it. They're not hiding themselves, they're there, they're following a, a path, that's the word I was looking for. Um, seem to follow the same path. See that? I'm going to go back to the window because I think that's more um, clearly you can see them better. And on this recording, on this section of the day, I'm just going to focus. Where's that? I'm going to focus um, just to clarify a few things regarding human civilization. See that crap? And there's three of them, so I don't know which one the camera's picking up. I plan to get a handheld camera next week, so hopefully it'll be a lot clearer and a lot sharper picture. Fingers crossed they folks, like I know what I'm doing. So I'm going to go back, see it flash, I'm going to come back to that because they're there. Oh there you go, there's one there. Come back to that later time, so go back. So I go back. There you go, you can see we're flashing and it's flashing, it's not a light um, reflecting back from a windsill. And you can see the, the flats at the bottom, look at them flashing like buggers possess. Sick folks. Okay, so you can see where the flats are. The last bit you can see. Watch it again. Ah, can you imagine me with a camera? Come call it up. Seriously. It's like you can see some flashing. I don't know if you can see that, I'll go back to the one at the top. I do think it's a light from the reflecting back. Bring this up. I don't think it is a light. You can see it moving independently. I see it glowing independently. That was the light. I mean, so it's been one spot. I can see it changing. That's my camera trying to focus. Don't think, um, should I say this centre? Don't think, um, when I see questions, it my family questions tonight because I can't get a really good picture. 
Schau, ich würde sagen. I was going to ask questions regarding um, the current the current cultural shift on earth regarding um, black, brown, Asian, yellow skinned people being sort of like a sudden thrust into the media and why it's been why it's happening. Um, like I said, I'm not the only person going through this. Um, I mean, this be contacted by their family, by their clan. Okay. Um, and the earth, there's lots of others like me. Okay, I have no interest in UFOs, just as part of entertainment. Uh, and with, I don't know why. Okay, it's just happening. Uh, the majority of the people on earth are black, brown, Asian, yellow skinned people. So that's the majority of people that are having a contact. And that's what I said in the other post. Um, all the UFO people that were doing it for X amount of years, don't matter how many years, if they've come to you and said uh, that the majority of people, you know, the the aliens and the humanoids have got blonde blue eyes and that's all they've ever said that's all they've ever seen um it's a psyop they're lying and like i've said previously let me get to the center sorry it's a psyop they're lying um as i said previously i've seen a group called i call them protectors i don't know what the names are they are akin to angels um and they were surrounded when they first started getting targeted. They surrounded me um, to protect me. And they were all nationalities. Don't ask me to say the, the E word. You know, I can't say it. All nationalities, all races. They look completely different. There's some pe races that look like they're mixed with three or four different races, some people should say. Um, all look different looking. Magnificence from really black. From Asian and Asian, I mean, from sort of Asian and in the Pakistani or or Indian um, ascent. Um, Asian, sort of Chinese or Japanese, um, black Chinese, Japanese, broad nose, very African looking people, so very people that are very light skinned. Like I said, the um, guy that. Uh, Contacted me at first. Was looked um looked um European, a tan skin, uh, or light brown skin. So, and he, I don't know if he was my spirit guide. I don't know what he was. Um, but he's the one that made the first contact, and he's the one that was getting angry. I was visibly angry. I kept saying to this creature, "Beast, leave me alone. Stop it." Blah blah blah. Okay. That's when I said I think one of my pace did I was just of um what's the Stockholm syndrome? What's the stocks? It's a specific word if you're black that you automatically um it's not it's called it's a specific sociology term anyway that you take on the um traits of your um the people around you, the culture around you and you reject your own culture traits. I thought it was something like that. I was thinking, can I? I didn't think I was uh, projecting a black trait. So I was going to think of some an angel or something, an ancestor with black. And I was like, oh, what's this? Anyway, yeah. Anyway, the people saw the protectors of this group of people and they are more ascended beings than us, the my clan. Okay? They are ascended beings. They are near to the creator. Okay? In, in their... Uh, I'm so slow saying, okay, again, folks. Place. So if you're drinking, have a swig every time I say it. So they are more to the angels at the same level, I would say, to angels. But they are not angels, even though they surround me. Male and female, of different heights, different looks. Um, but they were taller than humans, even though I was lying down, I was in bed. It's difficult to describe it. 
uh, but I was lying down in bed. And even though I was lying down, they still looked, I could tell they were taller than humans. Even the shortest one was taller than humans. The ladies, some of the ladies had hair up to the shoulders, some of the men had hair down to the shoulders, some had short hair, afro hair. Um, they looked all, they all looked, had different looks, not like humans, but different looking humans. And like me, the ego, I guess, I was wondering why I found them all so beautiful and they all looked so different and different ages. And I was just looking at the faces, I couldn't, I couldn't work it out why I felt I was just in awe of them. Anyway, so these are the people that we come from. Sort of, you, yeah, we are, we are based in their image, okay? The people in the crafts that you see, uh, when I say hello to my granddad Wayne, are also human looking. When I said things about the reptilian, I'll, I'll go on to that if I can be bothered after this. And anyway, I'll carry on about um, what's happening now. So any um, UFO, that's all for the last 20, 30, 40, 50 years, I've said blonde hair, blue eyes, and that's all they've seen. And they've suddenly switched their thinking to go, oh, We've got some brown people. Oh, look at that. Yes, I've seen some brown people. Look at them show up. Oh, so many negro features. Well, they're not really brown. They're, they're Aborigines. Or, oh, this and that. They're lying. I'm telling you right on here now, the lion, the sile. Because that, that was the first group of people I've seen. And I've always seen if I've been in contact with um, anyone. Like I said, you've seen anybody that knows me. Okay, knowing that Wade is white, so it's, this is not a race thing, and I keep I don't it say repeated that, but I also want to say that there are some humans. Look about, look at the people who's targeting me, the managers, etc. That are not human, that are subhuman. But when I get back to that race, there's nothing really to do with it. It's not at this point in our civilization, in this making of our civilization, race has nothing to do with it. But the negative entities has brought race into it, so we fight with each other. So there be, there's always been a division. They've always brought gender into it. So male against female. And it's not not even that we don't they don't do male against female. It's a ridiculous concept. You work together as a team. Anyway, welcome to my little rant. So yeah, so with the new new age community are saying all of a sudden they started to get it's do with a DNA and it's the black DNA or original humans DNA um, or the original Aborigines or whatever they're saying now however they want to put it it's a psyop because they can't the people that have the most contact now on earth and it's only because we are the most majority of earth it's black brown and yellow um, oriental looking people Asian looking people and dark skinned looking people it's only because We've been brought up in a site, especially in the UK. I'm speaking from the UK. We're all we've seen of dominant um, cultures and of civilization. All we've been shown is that they're, they're white. Or all, all the positive images we've shown about the different, um, even now, that the, the inhabitants on Earth and they've got to look into their cultures. Cultures has always been white. Even if we look at somebody, um, a culture like. Um, Australia, they show they'll have occasional Aborigine people, but the programs of such a sector will be white. Now that's changing. I can guarantee you, even even in Australia, the original Aboriginal people will be forefronted in their adverts now and in the TVs and blah blah blah, because the powers that be are hedging the bets. Um, I don't just want to get you know this the solar races are folk. Um and if they could find that they're doing so two things are happening at the moment, okay. Um the they know that the majority of people have been seen around on earth are uh, of black brown blah, blah blah blah. Okay, that's happening. That doesn't mean to say that white people uh or cook Quite mistake, Caucasian. I don't know words. 
Fuck you, anyway. I can't say words anymore. Fucking hell. Anyway. I've got to say, that doesn't mean um, that they are the devils or, or they are less than the original people that have got tan into the skin. <sighs> you know how hard it is to be so, um, I'm trying to be quite, quite precise without offending too many people. The mere fact I'm having this experience, it was pissing people off, no end. Amount of work, the amount of uh, middle class white people, this is pissing off. I like that bit of it. I'm not going to lie to you. I do find a bit of slang to fuck them up. Hands up to that. They deserve it. Um, but for other people out there, I don't want them to, um, because this is happening now, I don't want them to feel, if, the, if they're white and loved there, and they've said, oh, God, you're, you know, the fucking housing managers and the police are white, you know, saying all white people are this, all white people are that. I'm not saying that at all, and I will never say that, and like, I've, like I've just said previously. Um, and anybody that knows me would know I would never just know who I am, okay? And like I said, Wayne is white. Um, but I, I don't know if it's my guardian angel. Some people would class him as white or European looking, tan skin. Um, it's ridiculous, darling. That's what all races say, isn't it? How can I be? How can I be a racist? I've got a black cousin. How can I be a racist? I have a curry every Friday night. Anyway, so that's so that's the reason. Okay, um, things will change, and that's the reason um, we're seeing a lot of ethnic minorities, the powers that be, are throwing them into the spotlight. We are being gaslighted so much. Black, brown, orange. No such thing as Irish people, black, brown, yellow skinned Chinese people. But it's not even funny because the racists are still out there, and like I said, they're doing this as a two pronged attack to um, control society so more people um, will mate with other races that they want to, they want to um, thought of race um, mating before, okay. Um, and to destroy them. I know in the UK, oh, fuck you know, I'll tell you about West Midlands Police. Like I said, what you're going through now, what's happening now, I've been through that in my little sphere, in my little world. It's happening on a much larger scale globally. Okay. Um, they, I said, okay, they get another drink. Okay. Uh, I said it again. They are still as racist as fuck. But if they can control and destroy um, society that way and make people doubt and question their own existence, if their own parents, the white parents, turn around um, one day and call them a packy or a nigger, can you imagine how that will feel to a child? Okay? 30, 40 years from now, or the grandparent does it, or whatever they're still so they're playing two games here they will never completely give you the complete, complete history of earth because what they've done what and I've, and like i said previously what have the um ruling classes have done has been carried out such tortures um and abominations i can't say the word abominations anyway such inhuman torture inhumane practices that that is their that's that is that's their call that is who they are they won't change and to get that out in the media and to be completely frank about their history and I'm talking about the British history here, to be, to be completely frank about it, so everybody knows, so all the children know exactly what's happened, and in the true history of, say, the UK, uh, the Caribbean islands, or how, what they've done in India, what they've done in, in, in Ireland, what they've done in swathes of the earth, 
um, and different cultures and different countries of the earth just for power. Um, it would never, the real story will never ever come out. Okay, the real reason of that will never come out. But you know, we'll throw in a, um, a mixed face black woman to, to rule the family. We won't talk about it. And to keep you on edge, keep you so you, you know it's not completely gone away, we'll just keep sort of like so we're doing that story about racism. Okay, just we'll just keep you on your toes. And the people that we will um, select, the black historians, we will select them and we will tell them what to say regarding your history, the black history, um, or the Asian history, or whatever history that has that's happened in the UK. That's how it's going to go. They want to start also to make, that's why they will never say, because they also want people to be, uh, I've noticed with my targeting, they want me to constantly be, to be anxious, to be scared, um, to be fearful and to lock down. When you're scared or when you're fearful or when you're surviving and you're thinking about your health and you're thinking about surviving day to day, you don't have no time to relax and to meditate um, and just to breathe and to be still and connect, connect with the energies that are coming in. So that's why they will never do one big you know, out and tell the truth, this is it, okay, it won't take, 10 years for people the shock of it and people to realize what's going what's happened so they will never do that they, they will just like they are, they're just gaslighting us they, they know um still carrying on racist practices um and they will continue carrying that on no matter where you are in the world i'm saying this too but i think in the uk because i know the uk that's what they've got, that's what our government's like um and like i said in the previous post about lying they will lie be blatantly and not just black people are being gaslighted all of us are being gaslighted in the uk what else lying like i was saying if you want to know who somebody is are they a pathological liar if you want to know if they're original if they have originally human dna if they have if they are original human soul if they are original human and got hearts of the heart centered, if someone's a pathological liar, they've cut off all connection. There's, there's nothing that connects them to higher beings. Okay, I don't just want to say pathological liar. Move it across. Do you think it's? Do you other think it's a crap? Our family. Um, what else did I want to say? I think that's it. I think I've gone over what I was going to say. I was going to say something else, but I've forgotten it now, so I've gone over there. But this is, yeah, the the all of a sudden influx. And um, the amount of people, um, black people, that are in on this, but they're just getting their flesh. You know, they get their money, they've sold their energy, they've sold their soul to be part of this group that's doing all this for everybody. It's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. And the people you would you wouldn't think are involved in this. Like I say, I'm being targeted, I know I'm being targeted. You, the UK, in the UK, uh, you don't know you're being targeted yet. Most of you don't know you're being targeted yet. And when you find out, it's, it's going to get such um, um blow to your soul that you will not want to carry on. You will not. You'll be such a shock that the people you hold dear, um, the, the celebrities, the politicians, uh, the social influencers. If you notice, they've sort of all of them to come on the scene. The comedians, um, there's not one person in the public eye 
I'm trying to think of one person, even people that I like, even people that say the same things that I think regarding the UK politics, I know that they're, that they're just speaking from the handlers. The handlers, there's a group of people telling them what to say, how to say it. Even with policies that I agree with and they say that, and I know that they're doing it to, to, to mix up emotions, to gauge emotions. Which is a shame, but there it is. Comedians um, presented. Okay, some of them, yes, okay. I mean, I know that I can see the attachments on them, so it's okay, it makes it a bit easier for me. But, um, hmm. okay, what I was going to say about lips was at the tip of my tongue. I've got it. I was going to speak about the creature beast and go on about um, who's involved. And I, like I said, I'm going to keep the, the post separate because um, it's going to be um, the beast, dirty, dirty, the fucking experience for me. But the flip coin part as well, if it wasn't them being so fucking subhuman I wouldn't have learned so much I wouldn't have seen so much so swings are right about say folks but yeah um, I think that's what I want to say uh, but like I said go back and check if, you, if you're if you following somebody now who says they're uh, spiritual advisors or they say the UFOs or they say the contact you go back to when they first started their channel and see what they've said Go back because if I think we get the very beginning of their journey, they should tell you this. They should they should have said this the humans. And if all the same because I am not um I know what group I'm part of. You can see them, not the family. Yes. Um but I have seen all the other entities and other people in your soul group will come to your help. I'm not an I I'm not an angel far from it um, and my uh, clan are not angels but did some, the, the all the protectors I should say I sh did some, the protectors come into my aid it stop other groups in our soul group coming to our aid coming to my aid I should say Can you get going now? Can you hear the beast? Do you know when I talk, do you know when I say to you as well? Oh, I've tried to be enlightened. I do actually mean this part of me actually means that. And then because these creature beasts just have stopped, part part of me wants to punch me in the neck repeatedly. Several times a day. Okay, I'm gonna be off this one. Oh, thank you, Wayne. Thank you, Grandpa. Thank you. And I see what I mean, folks. You don't have to. They know. I we are such a what the original human beings were warriors, we were fighters. Okay, I don't want you to hold on to that. And if you know how much how powerful we are. Just in our energy, if you knew how powerful we are, fucking you know, Johnson wouldn't be a problem, if I could tell you that for a start. You would take shit off no one. Okay, though, can you hear them? Seriously, want to punch them in the neck. And saying all this as well, um, you know how docile you'll you've seen this for yourself, folks. You see how docile the new age community of religions has made us be towards negative shitty beings. If I weren't repulsed by their energy, if I weren't repulsed by them, I would they would have my energy now. I wouldn't just know where I'd be doing this. Literally. 
I want reports by fucking beast. There's no way I, I would be doing this and they would have my energy and I would have could have had a nervous breakdown and I'd be sitting somewhere rocking myself to sleep or fucking get some racist to shag me. Seriously, these people are fucked up people. In inverted commas. So fucked up it's not natural. Okay, so I'm going now. Well, I'm not going. I'm going to swing it around, turn this. Thank you, family. Thank you, Wayne, Randall. Thank you. Oh, I'm silly. I'm, I'm, let me go. I'm going to see if it, they're still there. The three. I think they've gone. I think they've gone. I think they've gone. I think they've all gone now, I think. Said what I'm gonna say. Okay, bye, folks. And I was trying to be more. Um, I forgot words now. Literally, I forgot some words. I, t I tried to be more um, diligent in my posting. I'm gonna post to you as well. So um, I've got posts that I've done early on in the week. I think it was Monday. That's the level of fucking posted. You know, I've got little clips. If you go onto my channel, you'll know you'd have seen them. But if you go onto, if you're on Facebook and you see, you see this clip, like I'm gonna post this clip on Facebook. Anyway, forget it. You no, know, if you go onto Facebook and you see both, you know that I don't post things straight away. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, hilarious. Okay. Bye.